YouTube, this is Boxing Mind TV with another video. On this video, man, I want to talk about uh, the notion that Terrence Crawford should face Kale Brook next instead of the Mean Machine. And um, I disagree. Um, I don't think he should fight Kale Brook next. You know, um, fighting Kale Brook at this point in his career doesn't help Terrence Crawford. You know, some of the notion that people saying uh, Terrence Crawford be good to fight Kell Brook. He's a name, and he's big and strong. You know, he's one that he's he used to be one of the best welterweights in the in the in the division. And um, yeah, all that's is true. You know, but beating Crawford, now beating Kell Brook right now wouldn't do nothing for his for his resume. And what's up, boy? my son all right thanks man um beating beating uh kill brook wouldn't do nothing for his career right now it wouldn't do nothing um knowing that knowing that he's just you know he just got beat by he got beat by the got beat by earl spence and he hasn't he hasn't been active he hasn't fought in over um uh, almost a year now and um he's been slated to fight on the saudi arabia card of uh Joshua versus Ruiz uh, rematch. He's, he's planning on fighting on that, but he's still not fighting a credible opponent to see where he's at. You know, he he hasn't beat he hasn't beat a notable opponent yet. So you know, fighting fighting Terence Crawford fighting Kelbur right now wouldn't do nothing for him right now. It'll be the narrative would be that uh, Kel Brook um, was going to be beaten by Terence Crawford either way because. He hasn't shown anything that showed that to prove that he's still on top. He got beaten by Gluffin, got beaten by Earl Spence. He's a shell of himself, you know what I'm saying? And why wouldn't you think a pound for pound, top pound for pound fighter like Crawford, that's that's probably one, one either you know either, either on the one spot or two spot in most people's heads. Why wouldn't you think he would beat him? So it'd be like an easy win for 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 Kell Brook. So I mean not for Kell Brook, for for Crawford. So it's like, it's, it's pointless for Crawford to fight him. You know, Crawford should be fighting, trying to fight Danny Garcia, uh, um, if he can't get that, or some, just other opponents that's been active. I'd rather, I'd rather Crawford doing what he's doing now and fighting, and um, fighting a, a, a person that's active instead of a person that's, you know, hasn't been active just because he, he has a name. Him fighting Mir Khan was a good move. You know, Mir Khan was, was, was getting active, you know, and, um, yeah, fights like that. So you know, let let Kelbro go fight Khan or something, knock him out, and then maybe it'll get the buzz going that you know he could fight. He should fight Crawford next, you know, something like that. But right now, it's no point in him fighting Crawford. He can go ahead. I mean, he's no. It's no point in him fighting Kelbro. He can go ahead and fight uh, Mean Machine and go from there, man. And go from there, and we'll see what happens next. You know, fighting those, fighting those guys until he can get a top guy that's active. You know what I'm saying? But till then. It's pointless to fight uh, Kelbert right now. And that's all I got, man. Boxing Mind TV, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what y'all think. Um, and um, I'll be back with another video. I'll see y'all, boys.